Okay, this is how I made the uh, spider web. So first, delete, 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 right here. Delete that, add, circle, select 16 vertices. 16. 16. There you go. Now, in edit mode, you can select all of these. They should already be all selected. So just hit E to extrude and right click. When you right click, they should just go right back into their own place, which they are. And here what we're going to do is S to scale. And that looks good right there. Any size, really. Any size would do. And then we're going to do edge loops. Edge loops. Right here. To loop cut. Control R. Loop cuts. Okay, yeah. Loop cuts. Right? And with the mouse wheel, just scroll up. And let's put a few of them in here. Left click to set that in. And then just right click. So this is what we have. Now, we select everything by pressing A. And we want to inset. I for inset. And then... Tap the I key for individual right here, right on top, individual, I, and set that to on, and then just slightly, slightly move it. So, so you get this little, like, square shape inside the square. And then left click. And once you get that, don't click off of it. So what you're going to want to do here is just X to delete. And then only faces. There you go. All done. So now you can select all, uh, right click to subdivide, and pop this little menu. I set it to two, and then right here there's a uh, fractal which will give it some noise. Let's give it some noise. Um, and then left click to set that in. And so you can select this. Doesn't matter what you select here in the middle, but what does matter is that you have uh, proportional editing. Make sure that's on. So when you scale, you get this big round wheel that you can control by using your mouse, middle mouse button. And I'm going to set it like this. And then I'm probably going to grab it by hitting G and then locking it into Z by pressing Z. And I think that looks all right. And there you go. That's, that's pretty much it. That's how I created the spider web. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something. Goodbye.